most exciting bass fishing when it's going right is top water fishing. Caught my biggest bass on top. And there's two times that, uh, two different times that I've had the best luck on, on top water. And uh, this, this is just speaking for myself. Either uh, late in the summer, early fall, or late summer evenings when it's been hot today and uh, just about an hour before the sun sets. They seem to hit really well. So I'm going to, right now it's about uh, about 95, 96 degrees today. It's still 91 degrees at uh, 7 p.m. So we'll see if the bass are active on top tonight. It's a bluegill. Huh. The old bluegill just grab my top water. Got a vintage head and dying flutter lure a really cool zebra pattern top water lure we're gonna throw it out and see what we can get Oh, he got off. Oh, man. <laughs> Little jumping at it. I've been trying to steady retrieve with this thing and not really producing any strike, so I'm going to kind of stop and go and see. Oh, something nice just jumped and missed. Oh, God. Nope. Oh, my goodness. Grab a hold of it. Oh, he's got it. Nope, he don't. That, now there's a small one trying to jump at it. It's all messed up now. These big bass must be blind. This one's got nine, <laughs> nine hooks on it. Three treble hooks. Yeah, I think they like the stop and go retrieval better.
different places, different times. You just got to test out different methods and, and see which one's going to work. Sometimes a continuous retrieval will work. Sometimes a stop and go will work. Or maybe you want to do a walk the dog pattern. Got him. He's small, but... Not too bad. Yes. The head and dying flutter. Bass are loving it this evening. Something else is trying to grab a hold of it. Oh, <laughs> he just popped that thing out of the water. Basically reeling for about five seconds and then stopping for about two seconds. Seems to be the magic number this evening. No, I missed it. Ooh. 
I don't know. Two hits right there. I don't think it was big. But hmm. Goodness. Messed up on that cast and my line got hung up a little bit and as soon as it hit the water he was all over this thing. Oh, oh boy, he grabbed as soon as it hit the water and he got off. Oh! Largest one of the night. He is a good four or five. He's another pound or two. Might have warranted me throwing my fishing pole. Hey, you golfers do the same thing. They are really good at throwing that hook. Monster bass that just tried to go after right in front of me. Oh man. Oh man. <laughs> Not gonna get five feet at least off the cast. He threw that lure about 30 feet. Good grief. Grief McCloppy. Topwater is so much fun. <laughs> <laughs> 